all right yo welcome back to another video guys your boy jonathan doing a little vlog for this one here this video here i'm in the city of burlington i personally think that this is the highest vibrational city that you can be in you know if you live here you're lucky if you live here you're lucky um the highest vibrational cities in the gta burlington ontario oakville ontario milton ontario what else uh mississauga is up there and then the rest of them are kind of just weary and then you know brampton it goes brampton then it goes scarborough and it goes low from there but you know those are the cities uh the highest vibrational cities but in this video today i want to talk to you guys about um how to better your mental health how to feel a lot better in your life you know a lot of people have suffered from like depression and anxiety they suffer from a lot of negativity you know i used to suffer from a lot of trauma negativity bullshit when i was growing up and you know the reason why i made these videos is to help people to not suffer from those things to actually elevate themselves out of the depression that they're feeling so i want to talk about three things it's going to be a quick short vlog video that you guys can do to raise your vibrational frequency to get out of depression and to get out of the negative emotions that you're All right, feeling so the first thing you guys want to do is meditation meditation is going to allow you guys to get present to the moment it's going to allow you guys to uh be able to come at peace within yourself and it's going to allow you to raise your dopamine and serotonin in your brain so these things like dopamine and serotonin this like if you don't have enough running in your brain you're going to be suffering from a lot of depression um negativity uh you're not going to have very good social skills and you're going to be very in your head and moment you're not going to have those euphoric moments um you might run around chasing a lot of external things like money, women, if you're a woman, men, relationships, uh, fitting the beauty standards or whatever it is. You know, you're going to be running around chasing a lot of that kind of stuff. So meditation is going to allow you to become present to the moment. It's going to allow you to move into uh, a better version of yourself. And it's also going to allow you to release a lot of childhood trauma and negativity that you're feeling in your life. So meditation is the first one. So, yeah. So the next thing you guys want to do is releasing childhood trauma. You know, a lot of us from childhood, we suffer from a lot of trauma in our lives. And this trauma makes us, uh, it, gives, it gives you a weird off kind of vibe. And it can make you um, resonate with people, places and things that will further um, mess up yourself make you more depressed or further make you uh more into the state that you're currently already in so a lot of times when we suffer from a lot of trauma and negativity um you know it kind of messes us up so you want to what you want to do to release this is like stuff like meditation you got uh release practices and much more you want to be able to move more into that and as you can begin to release that and let go of the trauma that you felt in your past you can begin to feel happier you can begin to feel more of that serotonin that dopamine and much much more so yeah and now the last thing the number third thing three the last one is the people you surround yourself around if you're around people who uh resonate with negativity resonate with gossip resonate with um just toxic bullshit What's gonna happen to you? You're gonna be, you're gonna become like that. You are the five people you hang out with. And because you are the five people you hang out with, you're just gonna become like that. It's just a, it's just a fact. Like when I kind of switched my circle, when I kind of switched up my circle, I started to become more like the people in my circle, you know? When I started to spend more time with myself, I became more at peace because I wasn't taking in all the energy from people, places and things and all sorts of stuff like that. So again, the people you're around, you know? If you're around a bunch of people who love being present in the moment, who love to live life, who love to just explore and just love life, you're gonna you're gonna love life. But if you're around people who are negative and who resonate with just drama, like all these shows, you ever see the Ultimatum? Like it's a good show. Like the Ultimatum is a good show, but it's it's negative. It's like it's negativity. You know, I watched it. I still watch it. I still engage in partying and drama and stuff like that. But you can't live there if you're living there and you're around people like that on a consistent basis you're gonna feel that negativity inside yourself and you're gonna be slowly become like that so again you want to get away from people who are negative so you're not like that so again those are the three things 
I hope you guys enjoyed the video for today. I hope you guys see the value the video has to offer and tune in for more videos to come. Thank you guys so much for watching.